how do I budget? I looked at my bank account and asked, well, how much do I got? And no, that's not the right way to do it. I was an E4 in the army. I had a wife and two kids, and I will never forget the day that we were approved for welfare. That day, I realized that I made so little, I really needed full control of every cent in my account, and the budget was born. Budgeting sounds so incredibly boring. It's also probably a daunting task, right? Nobody wants to do it. So if it helps you, just call it whatever you want. Your spending plan and allowance, your beer budget. Either way, it all comes down to managing cash flow. What's going in and what's going out. Step one, do you know how much money comes in your account each month, AKA income? We are talking about paychecks, BAH, BAS, or any additional income. Right, whether it be grandma's birthday money, some blackjack winnings, bar mitzvahs, whatever you have. If it's a deposit, it's income, so count it. Step two, know what you spend and more importantly, what you need to spend. These are bills that you'd have to pay even if you were deployed or locked up for a year. Like, have you ever heard of COVID? You know, for example, we all know that you need toilet paper, but now we know we don't need 45 packs of it. So these are essentials that you can't live without. We're talking about food and shelter here, right? Something to eat and somewhere to eat it. We all need a cell phone or a car, or in my case, a motorcycle, but we'll get to that later. Now this is simple. Just take step one and subtract it from step two and then bang on. You started your first budget, but that's not all. You haven't gotten away that easy. Step three, pay yourself. Savings are important. You may not need savings to survive today, but you sure might need savings to survive tomorrow. <laughs> the truth is, you never know when life's gonna give you that figurative punch in the face. But when it does, you'll need savings. If you don't have savings, it'll be all about survival because the need for more money will interfere with your ability to pay for those essentials from step two. So remember, Always pay yourself first. I live by the creed, I'm dumb and I know I'm done. So do like me and just choose to save automatically so you don't have to worry about this step. It's simple to do. Just get with your bank and set up an automatic deposit into your TSP or a high interest savings account, done. So let's sum it up for the people in the back who aren't listening. One, know what comes in. Two, know what goes out. And three, pay yourself first. If all of this sounds too hard and you're still afraid to build your own budget because you skipped the course that was held by your FRG, make it easy and just call a credit and debt coach. There you'll figure out where your beer budget has gone wrong or right. See you next time on John Wayne's World of Money.